Our top story that uh, we are tracking at this hour is uh, the first arrest that has been made in Maharashtra in the neat, uh, uh, neat case. Maharashtra police has filed uh, in Latur has filed a fresh FIR. Four people have been booked and one accused has been arrested. Now, uh, these accused also include uh, some of the teachers. Now, cases of cheating and conspiracy has also been filed. Uh, and a teacher, uh, he passed uh, students in exchange of bribe is what uh, this probe is saying right now. Now, Maharashtra gang, uh, it helped, uh, it was helped by a Delhi-based accused is what we are hearing. And Radhika joins us uh, to get us more details. Radhika, amid the nationwide crackdown that is happening at the moment, first arrest has been made in Maharashtra. What are the details? That's right. First arrest has been made in Maharashtra as far as the NEET exam scam is concerned. Four people were booked. FIR registered against four people, including two teachers, a trainer, as well as an individual from Delhi. Of the four, one person has been arrested. His name is Jalil Patan. He is a Zilla Parisha teacher who has been arrested by the Latur police. Now, yesterday, ATS had questioned two of the teachers and they let them go. Post which, uh, uh, you know, several incriminating evidence were found by the police after which the arrest took place. The other three are on the run. Uh, in fact, uh, efforts are on to arrest the other three as well. So certain revelations have come forth in the FIR. Uh, about the involvement and role of the accused. Uh, the police has in fact found a hall ticket as well as several other exam related materials on their phones, soft copy photographs of exam related materials of candidates and also online financial transaction also being found and several suspicious conversations and WhatsApp chats among all the accused as far as the details of candidates are concerned. We are also being made to understand that uh, some of the accused were in touch with the candidates and they had promised them a help, a favour and information of uh, the exam uh, with respect to answers in exchange for money. So financial transaction, WhatsApp chats uh, uh, and hall tickets and other exam related materials have been found in their residence as well as on their phones post which the arrest has uh, taken place. In fact, uh, this one accused who has been arrested will be produced before the court in just a bit and there is a possibility that uh, more details could be unearthed and there is a Delhi based individual also among the accused and he perhaps could be the mastermind in the case and the police have uh, told us that this is a gang that had been working uh, for a long time uh, you know as far as uh, this uh, leak of a uh, neat exam is concerned and they were in touch with several candidates and uh, therefore uh, the scam being unearthed by Latur police there is a possibility CBI could be taking over the case and more arrests uh, likely as three people are absconding in the case. Right. Uh, in fact, um, uh, what we are hearing at this point is uh, that Maharashtra gang, uh, this gang in Maharashtra was being helped by a Delhi-based accused, uh, which basically gives a sense uh, that uh, uh, it is not just one state that uh, the problem is. It's, uh, it feels as if uh, the entire, uh, it's a gang that, is, that has spread its wing uh, across the country. Yes, certainly. It looks like a large network. The fact that Latur-based teachers, two of them Zilla Parishad teachers, another an instructor, were in touch with somebody in Delhi. They were in constant touch, uh, you know, as far as the details of candidates, mark sheets and other exam-related information is concerned. And there have been financial transactions also made. Uh, the accused in Delhi promising uh, the uh, teachers here that he will, uh, you know, put them through uh, candidates and students and so on. So looks like the network is uh, you know far and wide uh, perhaps there could be more arrest uh, the what the police are saying is that this individual uh, who is from Delhi of course he's absconding at this point could be the mastermind in the case and there is a possibility that he may be in touch with teachers from other districts and other centers as well so two Zilla Parisha teachers one trainer and one man from Delhi and one of the Zilla Parisha teachers in fact has been arrested um, more revolutions could come forward as to what the modus operandi was how they conspired for how long they had been conspiring and whether something similar uh, had been done in the past by the same uh, network of people uh, but several incriminating materials including whatsapp conversations as well as uh, you know hall ticket uh, soft copies and photographs 
were found from the residence as well as from the phones of uh, two of the accused.